Hello, this is Richard from DRA Patterson. I'm just making this quick video to show you how to wire a plug because the amount of times I come across clients who say, I know how to wire a plug, and then you just see messy, badly wired plugs. So I'm just going to show you how to quickly do it. Nice and easy. First, eat this bit of cardboard. Take that off, put it in the bin. Get rid of that. Everybody leaves it on. You need to get rid of it. Open the plug. Take the towel off. Left for the inside of the plug. This cable grip. You want to loosen that so you can get your wire in. Take the screw out. The other one. Don't take the screw out fully. Just loosen this so you can move the cable grip out of the way. Like so, and then your terminal screws, if you can loosen them, you need a smaller screwdriver. Loosen them, get the screw out of the way so that we can put in the wires. One thing just to add is the fuse. This has got a 13 amp fuse in, which is fine for the appliance I want to connect the plug to. But just make sure that the fuse you're using is correct. Now we take our cable, which is slightly prepared. We've got the leads here. Sorry, the wires here. The brown live, the green and yellow earth, and the blue neutral. Cut at the desired length. And just to make it ease for ease, we're just gonna put it alive in first like so just gonna get the copper nice and tight and pop that into the earth screw terminal and then we'll fasten that down nice and tight to hold the copper in place we have two other leads you may find it easier to pop the earth in at this stage just put that in the hole Push it down, make sure it's nice and neat and tight. And then we're going to tighten up the screw on this one. Nice and tight. And the same with this final one, the neutral the screw. Pull out. Push the copper wire in. Get it in nice and neat and tidy. So, I'm quite in, so I'm just going to use the screwdriver to help me get it in there. There we go, perfect. Tighten that up nice and neat. It's on there now, everything's out of the way, it's not going to get caught. Make sure the leads aren't getting caught by the screw head here, which is going to come from here. Get your cable grip, push that back across, put the screw back in there. You get the right screw, push that back in there. It's not the right screw. But connect it with the cable grip. Use your screwdriver then to tighten it. Like so. Just get nice and tight, and then do the other one. So your cable grips nice and tight now so the cable isn't going to move if anybody tries to unplug it by the lead um, the cable grip does its job and keeps that firmly in place we've got the li live in here neutral to the left earth to the top i think nice and neat so remember if it's a class of appliance you're not going to have the earth lead put the top back on put the screw in place Fasten the screw. Change the plug isn't a quick job. This is four, four and a half minutes so far. But there we go. We've got a newly wired lead. That is how you wire a plug, nice and neat. When you come to have to change a plug yourself, that's what you need to do. 
This video is brought to you by Richard of DRA Pad Testing. If you want to get in touch with me with regards to doing pad testing for you, these are my contact details. Our website draelectricals.co.uk Thank you for your time. Have a good day. Stay safe.